Hey, show this country why y'all the best fans in the world. Show this country why y'all the best fans in the world, baby. Let's go. Man coverage. Open three. For the slant, it is picked off. And a flag on the play. Intercepted by Trey Watson Sr. Dean Blandine on the it's command center. That was not. Because if they, if they have DP. It is a question on that. Did the ball at, get tipped look too? At my, look at my. There's a couple questions on this. Handheld. I've got a finger. It looks like it touches the ball. It's pretty close. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Anthony, Dean's looking at it right now, okay? Do you, what number do you have for the foul? We, you got a number or what? We got a tip. We got a there tip. Is no foul we got there? a tip. Good. Yep. Yep. There is no foul for defensive pass interference. The ball was tipped. It'll be first down, St. Louis. They already got their fan unis in the crowd. A St. Louis takeaway. Trey Watson Sr. gets the Battle Hawks the ball back. And it was tipped right there at the line of scrimmage by Carson Wells, deflected up, and the Battle Hawks defense stands again. Trey, there was some conversation whether that ball was tipped or not. What did you see on the play? Ball's in the air, you gotta make a play. Tipped, not tipped, doesn't really matter, man. Whew, I'm tired. But everything's better when you're in with the ball. That's what we wanna do, man. I'm just I'm so thankful to be out here. My wife and son at home. That's there who I do this for. You know, I get to I get to be out here so far away from the, the, the people that I care about the most. No one has any idea what I've been going through out here. But I'm just thankful. Ain't nothing better than playing this game. Ain't so nothing better at all. 40,000 people who care about you who are here today. It's a good problem to have on defense, though, with that crowd noise. What's that been like working through the group? It's been amazing. This, this is how football is supposed to be played. Loud. Aggressive, people saying all kind of crazy stuff. There, there's nothing better than this, playing a football game like this. Like I said, I'm just so thankful. This is too much fun. Great crowd. Thank you. Round combination is shade. Going deep again. Overthrow, and he's picked off. It's Joe Powell, the former Battle Hawk. Powell to the 30. Finally forced out of bounds in the Renegades with the biggest play of the game so far. Man, ball sails on AJ just a little bit here. I see what he sees. He sees Pro working across, tries to get it up and over, but the ball nose just won't stay down. It sails just a hair. Pro can't get a hand on it. And Powell makes the play. Just an unforced error there from the offense. Come on, Joe. Go, Joe. Go score. Go score, Joe. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Good job. St. Louis has not converted a third down yet today. 0 for 3. Pressure. McCarran to the slant. That's caught by Paul. And he's got a St. Louis first down. A gain of 12. It's a great route by Kroll. Good job by A.J. McCarron sitting in there, knowing exactly the matchup you want. You have a slot receiver with some cushion with a three-way go on the option route. You hit him on the slant. Back toward Katie George. George would love to get a score before he hit the locker room. Got it. Keep dusty. Stop. clock at two. Pressure from the left. McCarron lets it go deep. Caught. Touchdown, St. Louis. Darius Shepard. They lose three of six on two point conversions this year. Over the shoulder catch, pylon touch, good! Brian Hill with the conversion. You talked about the hand signal, McCarron and his receivers. Thing of beauty, great job by A.J. McCarron. Unbelievable two-play sequence. Look at the hand signal, he's gonna look to his left. He's gonna say, Dusty. 
which is a wipe down, but he tags the inside guy on a corner. When he touched the elbow, that's a corner route. That's standard. Pretty much universally, that's a corner route. So he tags Shepard on the corner, one-on-one -on -one against the safety. You get a slot receiver, easy check, easy throw, a great audible by the veteran quarterback, A.J. McCarron. Thanks, Tom. A.J., heck of a response. What was your mindset after the last series? Uh, just keep playing. I mean, it's part of the game, right? Uh, turnovers is going to happen. This keep plugging along, keep doing what we're supposed to. Everything can work out. You touch that elbow. What does that signify? Uh, I, I can't tell you that. <laughs> we are tell him we know. We know. It's... Greg McElroy in the booth says he knows. He knows. <laughs> it's a great check. That's, that's old school Bama. <laughs> great check, but well, we appreciate. It. Thank you. Thank you. Nice throws. Fake the pitch to the right hand side. Boot. AJ back out to the left, and you should be able to get the split flow and hit the over working over the middle of the field. That's 22 Mitchell on the over. He was open, and he is still open. A first down, and he sneaks through to the 15. Donald Payne the stop. It's a gain of 19. On their feet in the low. You just see so much flow action from the Arlington defense working against the run. It's a great call by Bruce Gratkowski and an excellent throw by A.J. A nice run after catch, too, by Stephen Mitchell. Live line, Caesars has it. St. Louis given 14 and a half, up eight right now. And knock it on the doorstep. Here's Hill. Ryan Hill into the end zone. The hometown kid with the touchdown. Ryan Hill scores. Bet on two. So much room on the left hand side. Ryan Hill with nearly 30 plus in attendance supporting him takes it home as he swims for six. Gun double right towards you at Ohio Aspen. Ready? 200, 200, 200. Got your Ohio right here. Unless that safety comes down, that Ohio is stealing to the right-hand side. Safety stays back. Going deep down the sideline. It is bobbled and caught. Caleb Vander Esch got it out of Karam. Arlington picks up a massive game. A game in a league where nine points represents one possession. Nobody is ever out of it. Sloter took a shot in more ways than one. His gamble paid off as Vander Esch hauled it in for the first down. He took it away from him. Holy God. First base on the front. Third down nine. Slaughter complete with a sliding catch for the first down to Tyler Vaughns. Fourth catch for Vaughns today. Great throw, too. Really well timed. Vaughns see the safety deep. He rolls it right underneath that safety, right on time. If he stays vertical, he's going to get. Damian Smith, the running back. And Smith plunges in, but there's a flag down. Neutral zone. Okay, so we got this guy in the end, 5-6. Offside, number 56. Defense, that penalty is declined. Touchdown. to Smith, he's going to throw it, it is caught for the conversion by Canella. Kyle Sloter likes it. Renegades like it. They've done the impossible. They have quieted the dome in St. Louis out of this halfback pass to Sal Canella for the conversion. Nice play, nice job. Play. A nine point touchdown here, just given the score right now, but over still very much in play. It was 3-3 for yeah. 25 minutes of the ball game. Set. Be ready over here. Light 80! Light 
On second and six, a bullet complete to Shepard. First down. Good play call by Bruce Fredkowski. Well, here's an opportunity. You might get a chance. One on one fade. This could be a touchdown. Strike up the fight song if they stay in this look. One on one with a six foot six Butler in the slot. Do they have a fight song? There's the shot. Butler's got a half step. Touchdown, St. Louis! Just as they drew it up, it's a 25 yard strike from McCarran. Go figure, the fight song seems to be must. It's getting hot in her. Durant, the running back. Conversion good. Jake Sutherland. Ozzie Smith presented the game ball. We got Nelly on the speakers, and it's a St. Louis kind of party here in the Dome. Put some Clavel on the pizza, and we're ready to rock. See press coverage across the board. You know it's man coverage. You know you have a matchup problem. Plenty of room with him in the slot. Vertical. You knew before the play is even snapped, it's a touchdown. It's the best feeling in the world as the quarterback, knowing you're going to have that one-on-one -on -one with an opportunity to put some points on the board. Hey, Katie's with Hakeem Butler. You said you needed it. Stop playing with you him. said you needed it. Hakeem, heck of a grab, heck of a throw. How are you able to follow that all the way in? Oh, I mean, just lots of practice, you know. Me and AJ got chemistry. AJ got chemistry with everybody. He could throw to anybody, but, you know, I appreciate it. Tells me. You DM'd Coach Beck before the That's season. Him. <laughs> wanting to join this team. Yeah. Why? Uh, truly, I was about to give up football, you know. No opportunities, nobody calling, but, I mean, I know I could play. I've shown it through the first couple of weeks. But um, I just DM Coach Beck, really just asking for opportunity and information. He got back to me, so I'll forever respect him for that. He said he's going to get back to me, got back to me, and now we're here today. So I respect that man. I'll play for that man anywhere. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.